Hey, what's up? It's Prince the King. We're going to do a quick review of several online loan companies where you can get fast loans, some same day loans and next business day loans. And we're just going to talk about my experience with these loan companies. The first item is LendUp. LendUp is a loan company that offers short term loans as far as Usually with a payday loan, they only give you 14 days. But lend up, you have the option of choosing how much you want to finance. And on the page, they show you the finance charge, the amount. This loan, they also say that this loan will not affect your FICO credit score. So that's the other part. And so if you got $350, you will pay $395. And you can also choose when you want to pay it back. So you can line it up with your payday. So they give you a lot of time. Let's see how many days that is. So that's about 24 days to pay the item back and also with lend up if you are unable to pay the item off in time you can ask them for an extended payment and but you can only i think it's only once in a, a 12 month period where you let's say after 24 days you can't pay it off you tell them your situation i got like a student loan wage bonus man so i was telling them my living situation and i was honest and this is what they offered me so instead of me paying 235 dollars right there i okay so they offer me to where i would pay 58 dollars four times to pay it off and let's see when the payday came i didn't have to pay the 200 dollars. by them stretching it out let's see how many days by them stretching it out that gave me my next payment is in due for 44 days 44 days and it the payment the 235 was divided by four payments and so and I'm only going to pay $58 one, two, three, four times. And that's it. And after that, I'm done with the loan. And there was no, there was no fee. It's the, the numbers were broken down to pay the amount that I owed. And there was no extra fee. So that's 44 days before I start paying. And then, so it's 44 days until the next initial payment. And then, and then they stretch it out to where it's uh, 90 days fully. It will be over after 90 days. So 44 is when I start paying. And after those 44 days, I only have to pay $58 every 14 days. So and I would have to do that four times. And so it's almost like 90 days to really pay back a $200 loan. And then it's being split into small portions. Like the only thing is they don't offer this all the time. This is only for, you have to request this. You almost have to call them or message them and let them know the situation. You can't pay it and they will do this that one time, I believe. Also, they told me that you need to look for the extend button if you're eligible to extend the loan. And then there's also the payment plan button. And that's what I did. I pressed the payment plan and this was the payment plan that came out. And this is absolutely amazing. I think if you wanted to, if you needed to get a loan for a dire need, a short term loan, and you wanted to pay it back in a decent amount of time, I think that LendUp is a great company to to uh, borrow money from because it seems like they take into consideration the human aspect of lending and so by them stretching my two hundred dollars between four different paydays like that's that's amazing but they only do it one time per year they only do it once every 12 months i believe a lot of companies offer that item that what they allow you to stretch it out and i don't know if they charge fees or anything but linda didn't charge me anything extra and they gave me extra time i see why they say that they give you the opportunity they're giving you an opportunity to make Make the right choice and pay it back in time so thank you linda also with linda you can get your money as soon as the next business day i believe you have to go through a simple verification process where they send a message to your phone number and that they send a message to your phone number to verify your phone and your email stuff like that simple good credit is not required we consider all types of credit history just because your credit score isn't so great they still you can still get approved and also i had a bill that was like coming up i didn't i didn't know what to do like i, I was asking people for money and couldn't get any money from anybody so I started searching online and lend up. Um, I saw the email and it said, Congratulations, you know, you were approved. I was like, Wow. And when I saw that it was approved, I was just like, That's amazing. So thank you, lend up. I, I truly appreciate it. Thank you so much. If you're thinking about getting such a loan, I think that lend up is a great company for it. Next, we have next we have CashNet USA. If you needed a loan, a payday loan, another company to try is CashNet. If you didn't get approved for a lend up, then you can go to CashNet USA. I've, I've got a lot of loans from this company. Um, trying to come up with some strategies to make it uh, make this company better. And um, I know even though it's a payday loan company, uh, I like the fact that they give you the opportunity to pay it back. 
back over time. Most companies only allow that one-time extension, and it varies on how they break down the extension with fees and payments. But with CashNet USA, you're allowed three extensions. And so with a $300 loan, you would pay, let's see, and with a $300 loan, you would pay about $345. I have a promo code, or there are promo codes where you can make it lower. So usually I would pay $333. And also what I do is I wait until um, the week before, I think seven days before my payday, and I get the loan. That way I can skip the current payday, and I stretch it out to the next payday. And so it becomes it becomes a 21-day loan, and instead of a 14-day, it makes it pretty much easier on me. And after those 21 days, 21 days, I would have to pay 345 or 333 if the promo code works that I always use. Well, it, it would be 333 with the promo code. If, and then, so what if I can't pay it after 21 days? There are three extensions. So I would use my first extension. The only problem is that they will charge you or they will charge you a certain amount. They would charge you the same probably fee as, as a base loan anyway. So you have to pay a little extra, but you're paying a lower amount. And so, and you can also use the 30% off code to chop 30% of that fee. At 21 days, you have to pay, I pay about 106 and the remaining balance will probably have an extra $33. So like 256, I believe. Yeah, about 256. So, and that gives me 14 more days. And so I turn a 21 day loan into 14 35 by doing that that gave me more time to pay it off i would have paid probably a total of a total of 361 but it, it gave me a little bit more time to pay off the loan by doing it that way and so and then i have two more extensions and i can just pay 106 106 or however much it is that that percentage of the amount that you borrow is, this is, I believe, only with the payday loans. Or I call it a short-term loan because I can stretch it out to 21 days and then 30 days and then pay it off. And also, I believe um, if you pay it off early, that you can save money that way. I I use a 30% off code and then I paid it early and I saved about, what it is, $23? Yeah, I saved about $23 by doing it that way. So it's all a strategy into how you do it. But I think that CashNet USA is a great company. It's a great company. They um they also they offer same day loans. Um I believe if you borrow before ten thirty AM uh let's see. If you borrow ten thirty AM Central Time. If you borrow ten thirty AM after, so I mean, if you borrow 1031 Central Time, then the funds will be funded the next business day, and they, they don't fund on Saturday or Sunday, so no. So that's another thing that makes CashNet USA a great company, is if you need that money today, like you have a negative in your account, and you need that money to hit today, then this is one of them companies that you need to get the money from. And there are other alternatives that I want to be talking about in the future, in my next few videos, but if you're unable to do those things, then CashNet USA, LendUp, these are the companies you should look into. And also, they do a credit check, but the inquiry won't affect your FICO score, so you're good. Next company we're going to look at is Speedy Cash. Speedy Cash. I wonder why they named the company Speedy Cash. And then when I used the company, I realized why they call it. They call it Speedy Cash because this is probably one of the fastest loan companies ever. Like, and I've never had a company where I can borrow money from on Saturday. Like, that's insane. But Speedy Cash is a it's a good loan company. Speedy Cash, uh, they're legit. They offer debit card deposit, direct deposit, or pick. You have a debit card. They can send you the money instantly. Their instant deposits, I was like, this can't be real. And so I did it and it worked. And then one time I did it on Saturday and because I was like, if they say that they deposit instantly on a debit card, then it goes directly on a debit card. I probably won't have to wait. So I did it on Saturday night and I had like $100 in my account. So I had $100 in my account. I was like, okay, I like that. I like that. I like speedy cash. But, you know, it's pity loan. Depending on when you borrow the money, you can, it's a 14 days, but if you get one closer to your current payday, I usually try to get it on Friday. That way, the Friday before my payday, for me, my SMI thing. And usually I wouldn't have to pay for about 21 days or 20 days. And then I, I didn't realize it at first. I thought that Speedy Cash was like the, 
or you have to ask for an extension, you can refinance the loan to where you pay them a portion, a small portion of the loan, but you have to pay it now. And then they will give you 14 more days to pay it off. And so, and also Speedy Cash has been offered me um, a courtesy extension. When I get a loan, I always look for it to see, I always check the Speedy Cash website to see if there's anything that they're offering me, like the courtesy extension, of course. And I go on there, instead of me having to pay on my payday, they would give me four extra days to to get money to pay for the loan. I, I don't know if they would do that if you refinance. And once you refinance, they probably expect you to pay it on that particular day. And speaking of that, I didn't even know that I could stretch it out even more. Wow, that's pretty awesome. See, that's what I'm saying. Just go on there and check it out. And you might even have, they might even allow you to stretch it out even more. And all you have to do is click this. And for no extra fee, they will give you even more times speedy cash. They send the money instantly with the debit card. They allow you to refinance it. Give me four more days to pay it off. You really can't beat that. And also try to borrow small amounts. That way you don't you aren't charged too much and you can actually pay it back. And so and voila, that is all. So Speedy Cash is another good company. Speedy Cash because it's super fast, like probably the fastest money you'll ever receive if you connect your debit card and put instant debit card deposit. Like I like Speedy Cash. At first I was kinda like I, I had a misconception. I didn't I didn't realize that when you go refinance that you are you're paying you have to pay a small portion right there instantly. That's the other part you have to pay that small portion I believe it was like seventy dollars for me so you have to pay a small amount instantly but it gives you 14 more days and you might even get a courtesy for extra days i have like apps where i can get paid early and so i'm giving them extra four days i can accumulate money and use one of those apps and just pay it off or i could just pay it off just whenever so but i'm just using this as an example to show everyone how everything works so choose speedy cash and get money today get money instantly they all appear to be legit if you're in a jam and you need money, then try out these companies. Also, remember to not get stuck in that cycle of payday loans and, oh, all right, I got money. It's mine. I can go spend it and do what I want. No, you, you have to pay this money back. So think about that. You have to pay the money back. If you keep borrowing from the future, you'll always live in the past. Prepare for the future so that you won't have to borrow. And also remember to try to only get it when you are in a dire need, not for just random stuff to have fun and stuff. Like, do it. Be serious. Be serious about your money. Be serious about your money and be serious about life. So try out one of these companies. Let's just say the different situation. You got a bill coming up, but the way your payments or payday is set up, you might not be able to pay off within the next payday. And you should probably do Lend Up or CashNet USA. If somebody is in jail and you need the money like right now and you want to get them out like right now, then Speedy Cash is the one to choose. And fees are probably going to be high and you're probably going to have to pay it back soon. But I recently just saw the refinance button i was afraid to press it because and then the numbers i was looking at i didn't i didn't realize i didn't realize what it was i didn't realize that i thought i was gonna have to pay an extra amount i thought i was gonna have to pay like an extra 100 dollars, but in reality i didn't they were just telling me i have to pay 100 now and then pay the rest the next payday so it's not that bad so it's better than what i thought it was so when you see that refinance button if you have that money now to pay it now pay it now and then pay the other half the next payday and that gives you more time it gives you about an entire month actually it would give you if you did it if you got the loan seven days before your payday it should give you about 21 days and then on the 20 and then they give you four more days they might give you four more days so that's 25 and then probably if you can't pay that or when you pay that off then about 25 days to pay it off and you can also you can refinance too you can refinance the loan and just pay a portion and they give you 14 more days so it's about 35 days i mean speedy cash cash that USA lend up are all good companies and they appear to be working for you to I mean they're better than most payday loan companies those are the three companies that I have borrowed from and if I ever need to pay off anything I have other apps like even and earnings and I might try money line I have never tried that yet but I have those apps too just in just in case but when those fall short because of the small they only allow you to get a certain amount and so you still might end up short on the short end or just need an extra hundred if you really need the loan, then these are the companies that you should try to look at.